Controversy cutting into class time today at UH Manoa. Good evening, I'm Yenji Denise. Paula Akana has the night off. Protests over the 30 meter telescope took a new form today. KITV force Pete Kajano was just back from UH. And Pete, this issue had some people cutting class today. That's right, and not just students, Yenji. We've seen several different kinds of protests these past few days. The message that this one, this, one, this issue is not going away. We are not going to stop until this project is brought to a halt. In a show of unity against the 30 meter telescope set to be built on top of Mauna Kea, UH professors and students stage a walkout and rally at noon today on campus. We did walk out of our class. Uh, all the students said they wanted to come. A few hundred students attended the rally and others stopped by the UH Manoa Campus Center. The group declares the mountain sacred and worries about environmental concerns, even though university scientists assure there is no danger. The water you drink in Waiakea and Hilo comes from that mountain. How much pollution is going into that aquifer? Oh, our scientists on the holy site say, oh, no, no, no. No pollution whatsoever. None. Uh, hmm. I suspect there's a little bit of a white lie in there. And uh, there's a reason they say white lie. Okay. Protesters say public demonstrations are necessary to get their message across. The university and the TMT, they've been disregarding our input on this matter. And we are standing up for what, for our culture, for our land, and for our Mona. The speakers and students here at the rally say they're not anti science, they just believe the land should be respected. You're looking at Iolani Palace having electricity before the White House. So it's not an anti. In fact, I just came back from Berlin, and people were there like, oh, your king, Kalakaua, actually came here around the world. He was the first head of state to go around the world. So I would say just look back historically to understand that. And then also, it's an issue of respect for the land. Now, I spoke with university officials, and they say there will be no punitive action to students and teachers who walked out of class today. All professors will be paid as normal. Back to you.